This is the Great Barrier Reef in Australia. Here, at the Heron Island Research Station, marine biologist Ova Goldberg is studying coral reefs. Like the rest of the planet, our oceans are in trouble. Ha Goldberg has been studying the effect of climate change on coral reefs. His conclusion is that coral reefs are disappearing. Ha Goldberg says that coral reefs are a beautiful part of the Earth. The fact they are disappearing should be a warning to us all about the negative effects climate change can have on our planet. Coral reefs are made up of thousands of tiny polyps covered in an outer skeleton. The skeletons of these polyps form the structure of the reef. But global warming can cause the water to get too warm. Above 30 degrees Celsius, the reef begins to die. This is called a bleaching event. The Great Barrier Reef recently had two serious bleaching events. Large sections of the reef died. Marine plants and animals which live in this part of the reef have now lost their homes. There's another great threat to the reef's survival, the increasing amount of carbon dioxide in ocean waters. Carbon dioxide, which is a type of gas, is absorbed by oceans. Marine plants and algae use some of it to make food. Tiny sea creatures like polyps also use it to make their shells and skeletons. But too much of this gas turns the ocean acidic. And instead of helping these tiny creatures, the acid in the water destroys their shells and skeletons. It even prevents them from building new ones. Human activities such as cutting down of trees have caused carbon dioxide in the oceans to reach dangerous levels. We may think that tiny animals at the bottom of the ocean aren't important to us, but a lot of other sea creatures need them. So by changing our oceans, we are actually causing many species to be at risk of going extinct. <laughs>